Hello everyone and welcome back to Jacklet Educational Channel. So this is the time for the environmental science quiz which we conduct every week on Monday on this platform. Yes, this quiz is to prepare ourselves for the NET, GET or any other entrance examinations related to environmental science and to know something about our environment. So those who are new you should know these are the rules for the quiz contest and one must read all these rules before proceeding for the quiz. And the best thing about this quiz is you can be one of the top performer for the month and can win cash prizes along with the certificates. So if you want to win participate more and answer more questions correctly. So without wasting much time let's get started. So the first question is which pyramid can be inverted in a stable ecosystem? So I'll wait for certain seconds then I'll move on to the next question. So the second question is the hot spots are the areas with which of the following characteristic features you have to choose under the four options given that is extremely rich in species with high endemism extremely scarce in species or under constant threat Let's move to the third question the third question is a paddy field is an example of which kind of ecosystem so again the question is from the ecosystem So let's move to the next question. The fourth question is which one of the following environmental factors is responsible for the cyclomorphism in animals? So read every option carefully. Time is running out. Let's move to the next question. The next question is the lichen and the moss stages occur in which of the following states? So this is regarding the ecological succession. Let's move to the sixth question. The sixth question is an example of assertion and reasoning kind of question and the assertion statement is biosphere constitutes an excellent life support system which is sustainable and can fulfill all human needs and the reason statement states the size and productivity of the biosphere is limited by the availability of the water nutrients and the environmental conditions so let's move to the next question the next question is when the full potential of the physical chemical and biological factors a species can use if there is no competition then it is called as what question the next question is which of the following organisms can act as primary consumer secondary consumer and tertiary consumer or scavenger in different types of food chains so this is a very interesting question let's move to the next question the next question is the tendency of the biological systems to resist the change and to remain in a state of equilibrium is called as what So we are moving towards the final question of this quiz contest. And the final question is if different categories of the threatened species are written in a sequence, then what will be its correct order? So you have to identify the correct order among the four options given. So that's all in this part of the video. Hurry up guys and write all the options in the comment section. And stay tuned for the results part which will be announced tomorrow on this platform. See you guys in our next video.